So welcome to this uh, weekly summary. Let's uh, we're looking at one shloka a day from sixth chapter. Now let us summarize the first twelve shloka. So the story is that how to become a yoga aruda expert in yoga. What are the characteristics of a person in yoga aruda? The beginner is called yoga arurukshor. So what does he do? He definitely should not imitate. So a yoga arurukshor should. understand the state of yoga arvuda that is uh, yoga arvuda means he is not uh, uh, doesn't take shelter in the karma phalam means the result of the labor he works out of his swadharma and he relishes his natural spontaneous activity without having a target without having a sankalpa of karma phala that is a yoga arvuda but how to come to that yoga arvuda is that uh, the first step is we have to make we know the mind so that is the first step a yoga so the first step a yoga arurukshar has to do is to make the mind a friend and how to make the mind a friend is we have to win over the mind atmana jitaha and once you win over the mind the beautiful thing is we come very close to the paramatma and we develop the equanimity means uh, the outside wealth stone and gold is seen as same and friend and enemy as seen as same you will give a reaction of love for everyone that is the beauty of reaching the paramatma the super soul and so so this is a benefit this is a wonderful description of the state of the yoga aruda but to reach there one has to start step by step that is first one has to be in a seclusion place to do the meditation on the soul and one has to give up all the worldly desires possessive mentality that this is mine uh, i and mine kind of feeling one has to select a very sacred place and one has to sit with the spine erect with concentration on a good asana and target the purification of the heart to realize the encounter with the blissful soul and the super soul inside so friends the initial 12 uh, shlokas are, are describing a journey how to become a yogi expert the basics the abc to go become a yoga aruda to start with understanding that the heart is dirty so we have to cleanse the heart and when adopt a right physical posture spend some time in loneliness give up the worldly desires and have full faith that complete contentment and bliss is in soul 